The countdown to opening day continues. Steve Berthume here with Eduardo Perez looking at the Houston Astros. And Eddie, this is a team last year that finished strong in the National League Central. This year they have some questions. You got some young guys in this infield. Castro behind the plate, Wallace at first, Johnson at third. If these young guys can grow and mature, this could be a pretty decent offensive team in this division. And you said it, if is the big key. There's not a lot of speed there. Yes, Michael Bourne at the top, but after that, you're looking at a station to station team, and their defense is what worries me. They might be able to score some runs in that ballpark and in that division. But you look at guys like Billy Haw now playing second base as an everyday guy. Clint Barm is playing shortstop, which he was playing second in Colorado. You look at guys that it's a lot of ifs. And now they have to catch that ball, make the plays, and take the pressure off the pitching. This is the division in which everyone, it seems, has improved their rotation remarkably. Some very good pitching rotations in this division. Houston's is underrated, I think. They kept Wandy Rodriguez long term. Myers was terrific last year. People wait for Jay Happ to step forward, and Bud Norris throws hard. Yes, Bud Norris does throw hard, and he does control that St. Louis Cardinals offense. But besides that, you look at these guys, and the bullpen's going to put a lot of pressure on their starters. They're going to have to go deep into the game because their bullpen is where another big if is. And now you have Wandy Rodriguez and Myers at the top of that rotation. These guys are going to have to catapult that team and, start, and try to keep them above water towards the first half. Astros trying to improve on last year's 76-86 and 86 record. They finished 15 games back in the NL Central.